Hello guys, today I will speak about a team for the back end. Uh, I found it very interesting, especially now Odoo has done some rework on the version 9 uh, related to the back end, the layout of the back end. And in parallel, a company called 8Cell has um, produced a back end module that can be installed. So this is available. Um, directly in odoo.com slash apps teams for version 8.0 and it's called material backend team. I contacted the company and they gave me some access to their own system. So let us have a small view about how it looks like. The first thing you notice is that um, the layout is um, quite changed. If we go to the standard Odoo, it's gray, it's, it's nice, but it's gray and black. And here you have nicely done in um, magenta. So the things are a little bit oriented to what was done in the version 9 by Odoo. So it means that it's uh, much more readable and well structured and the colors uh, I kind of like them. If I look here more in the detail also the, all the fields are a little bit different. I must say it's uh, very beautifully done in terms of, of color choices. Um, okay I'm not so much a fan of the, the magenta but um, I, I like the green. I really like the green. So. This is how it looks like. You can see very beautiful colors. Let's see a list. The selection uh, field is a little bit bigger than it used to be. If we go to the same from Odoo, a list view in Odoo, you see here it's much, much smaller. So well done. It's a good uh, thing. Very near from the version 9 in the way it is done so that you, you don't see the full field you just see as if it was uh, just a line so here also everything is very nice and beautiful so i would like to show you something that i really really liked about this theme is if i go to the customers i have the cards and i believe that for a kanban view to see things as a card is really something that is much nicer. If I go to the same view in the standard Odoo, you see I cannot make a huge difference from one entry to the other entry, and here every entry is clearly as a card. Because it's a fixed theme, you, I'm not sure if it's possible to change the color, to do choices with the car. This is something that uh, Probably interested people would uh, discuss directly with um, with uh, the company. Maybe there are possibilities to to make changes. So, just in the few minutes that I've been looking into it, I find a very beautiful team. I find it's very nice to have a clean interface also for the back end. The other thing that I would like to 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 say is that they also added. A small facility to take away this menu that is on the left side so here if I click here I have I can use the full width of, of my screen what is what can be very very useful in, in some cases so let's say how much it costs I haven't really looked into it so they propose this for 150 euro okay I would say, even if I like it quite a lot, I don't believe that I would be ready to pay 150 euro just to have a nice uh, back end. Especially, I would say, the fact that I cannot change anything by myself um, reduces the value of this um, of the theme that I would be ready to pay. So. I would say on all the points, uh, I find it fast, I find it 
beautiful, I find it nice, but I find it uh, too expensive. So I, I would be ready to pay between 20 and 50 euro to have this nice hand, but 150 euro is, from my point of view, a little bit too much. So that was it for today. I hope you enjoyed the show. 